9-11, uh, talk about 9-11 a little bit, and also uh, what uh, recap too about exposing Day Washington Schultz. And uh, Harry Reid has support Obama. What do you make of all of this? Uh, go ahead, Rose. Well, nothing surprises me. I mean, we have to look at what's been going on for six years now, mm -hmm. not just what's been going on uh, recently. Right. Uh, we, we have to look at the fact that Harry Reid has almost 400 bills that he has supported and sitting on his desk and didn't let uh, go and moving forward that the Congress presented to him to help uh, protect our country from uh, economic uh, collapse and from wars and mm -hmm. from attacks by terrorist groups like ISIS, Al-Qaeda, and Hamas, and mm -hmm. all the rest of them, and from having open borders with unidentified cartel members linked up to terrorists, minor kids with viruses and diseases, all unidentified people coming to our borders. Right. So, um, so it's not a big surprise to me, and when uh, the president stated and declared, I believe it may have been through the Cairo speech, when he spoke in Arabic, uh, that America will never be at war with Islam. That's correct. He said that, yes, he did. Good, good, good analysis, great reporting. That's correct. He said that, yes, he actually said that. Uh, he addressed it to Cairo, and he also addressed it to good communal K, a great commonal K Cuba too as well. You know, a great commonal. So he, we address he addressed it there too as well. Club Gitmo, I should say. Club Gitmo, he addressed there too as well. I remember we're going to release the the people who are in prison is down in Gitmo. We're going to release them too. Remember this? And there's they they were on a do not fly list. Go ahead, Rose. Well, I think we have to take that question, which the mainstream media. Um, and I don't even think Fox has addressed. Um, they should have contacted me. I would address it. Uh, and Congress and the senators have not, to my knowledge, addressed what do you mean America will never be at war with Islam? Right. Because that is a declaration of his personal belief then, and it is not the declaration of the uh, Congress the Senate, or the American people, mm -hmm. and yet Islam, uh, ISIS, uh, ISIS uh, has declared war on America, and Islamic terrorists, aside from ISIS, declared war on America in 1993 at the OKC, and then again in 2001 at the Twin Towers. Right. So Islam has been at war with America for a very long time. So we have to ask the President of the United States, what do you mean when you state that America will never be at war with Islam when Islam terrorists have been at war with America? And, and does that mean that America is to just wait like sitting ducks while they are attacked and that the soldiers can't fire back without asking permission mm -hmm. because we are will never be at war with Islam. Right, but I like that. Well said. Well stated. And.